I'm getting ready to go hang up that last piece I was telling you about. I might, yeah, you might not have seen it yet, but it'll be in one of the videos soon. So I'll be having a solo art show at Scrap, and these are the business cards that I'm making for it. The show is all upcycled or um, artwork that's made out of 70% reused material or more. And so I made business cards specifically for that that are all reused material. These ones are out of a Cheerio box. I cut them out and then I have a stamper that you can see you go like that and then it shows your name. I have my name, my website, and my Etsy shop on there. And so all of the cards have that. I got the stamper at like a office supply store at a um like a UPS type store. So I made those and then I took them and turned them over and I have created the stamp. I created it quite a while ago. I made business cards several years ago that were all I carved out my email or my website in a stencil and so I made stencil cards. I did spray paint back then for that one. Um but these ones are stamped with just a couple different colors of paint and I played around with paint. This is one of my favorites actually. But I have a whole bunch of them. I'll move the camera. So those are all of them that I created. These ones are all finished. Sorry, I'm a little wobbly. But you can see the backsides of them. So I just finished matting my piece, my final piece for the scrap show. I'm super excited. I'll be hanging it tomorrow. Um, this may actually be in tomorrow's vlog, though. So, yeah. Alright, so this is my show. I still have two more pieces that the wiring is all messed up on for the hanging system. So it's an old uh, flower refrigerator in an upcycling store. So the last two pieces will go right there, but they don't work with the, the wire. So I'm headed to go hang up the artwork I have mentioned in a video or I will mention or show today or something, I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's actually snowing here. It's kind of cool. We've only lived here just over a year. Uh, we lived in the Midwest where it snowed a lot and was really, really cold. And it's been, last year we got like one kind of snow day where it was snowed and then it was gone by noon or like 10 a.m., I don't even know. But uh, this is the first like legitimate snow I've seen in the last year and a half, so that, um, it's kind of cool. All right, so here's the show. So this is the store that it's in. It's like a, a gently used art supply store. So you can go and donate your old art supplies that are half used or partially used. And then you can go and buy art supplies that have been half used or partially used at really amazing prices. And so it's, it's cool to have an upcycling show inside of a Scrap, which is an upcycling store. Hey guys, this is the probably final clip for tonight's Vlogmas, but on. Um, since I showed you guys the upcycled art show, I'm going to show you how I did some of the pieces that are displayed more like paintings. And um, some of them were collage. The two women figures were collage. And the other ones I used on um, newspaper, or I have taken newspapers and then just painted them together to make sheets of paper. So it's really, really thick. It feels wonderful. Like um, I've made books where I've uh, done pages, like accordion fold, accordion fold books, so it'll go like that. Uh, but yeah, this is just a big sheet. I wanted to show it to you. So what I did was I took paint and I painted, I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but I painted layers of newspaper together. And this is a like two separate sheets. I'm going to keep them together because they're stuck that way for now. But um, yeah, so I just took different layers of newspaper and painted them together. So like I used paint, old wall paint as glue. And I have thick paper that I've had some of these papers for like I did them sophomore year of college. I think I've had them for like six or eight years, uh, just waiting to use them. I used a few a couple years ago, and I still have like ten sheets maybe or more probably. I've made a few books. I have done several different things with them. But, uh, but yeah, I just kind of wanted to show you a little bit of a how-to on how I did those big paintings. And Oh, and then on top of it, so like the one that is the pink one, uh, that's one of my favorites, 
it is this, but then I did uh, ink and Sharpie. So like the ink pen that you dip and then Sharpie and other markers and I collaged paper towel on top of it as well. So like all sorts of different textures and that type of thing are on it. And the two on the wall are just cut out about the, the size of the frame. And then I did like henna designs using ink and Sharpie and then uh, acrylic inks as well. So all sorts of mixed media type stuff, just playing around. But this is a really fun technique if you want just like thick paper that is homemade paper but really good for uh, mixed media and collage. Yeah, thanks. Have a good night, guys. I will see you tomorrow in tomorrow's vlog. Happy Vlogmas! Good night.